Oh, hang on. Wait, wait. Second. Okay, go ahead. You can build Chinatown down there, just down in the valley there. And then you thought, well, it would get flooded. But what else can the Chinese people do? That's it. So, so, so you're saying that Chinatown is in the lower part of town, and that's why Chinatown got flooded in Cumberland. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's why Chinatown's in the lower part. Yeah. So I think I hear what you're saying is that they gave the Chinese the worst land. What did you say? They gave the Chinese the worst land. Oh, build. yeah. They said, you, you built down there. And where did the white people live? Huh? Where did the white people live? They, they live off the highland. You make sure that, that they their part will, will not be flooded. Oh. Wow. Yeah. So the Chinese had no choice. No choice. <coughs> the Chinese came over and they said, where can we build our uh, place? You build down there. Oh. And that's it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Were there a lot of Chinese in Cumberland when you were little? Were there lots of Chinese people in Cumberland? Oh, yeah. And how many are we talking about? I, I would say there was, must be at least a, a thousand. This whole place, all the way to the back to the to the to the mountain, were were built of houses. Oh, uh, but no you can say they're, they're really shack, well, you know, not not houses. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect. Thank you. But you can't have you, you can't have a, a basement Brush there because tea. otherwise you get flooded. Uh -huh. Brush yeah, tea. and then. You, you get flooded. Even our store get flooded. You know, I can, I can remember that. Oh. Did it flood a lot? Did it flood a lot in Cumberland? Huh? Did it flood a lot of times? In Chinatown does. Like, like every year it would flood. Pretty close, yeah. Oh, that's right. Did your grand? Did your father's store get flooded too? So did, 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 did your dad's store also get flooded? Oh yeah, that's right. I can remember when we always had to be prepared for the flood to come, to come because you see the, there's a dam up about here and, and then the dam overflowed <laughs> and the water come all the way down here, down to, down to our store here. Also, the so the, the the water comes down the main street to your store. Yeah, right. So the main, right street, the main street. Oh, the main street gets yeah. flooded to your store. Yeah. And what did you do? How did you how did you dry everything off? So when it flooded, how huh? did so when the store got flooded, how did you dry out the store? What did you have to do? Like move stuff out of the store? How did you? What did you do? Like we live upstairs, so, oh. so we're okay. But what about downstairs? Didn't everything get wet downstairs? Oh yeah. There? Oh yeah, that's right. Everything got wet downstairs. That's it. That's it and, sorry, what did what did your what did your dad sell? So what what did Charlie sell in the store? Huh? What did your dad sell in the store? Have it. What did they sell in the Chowdy store? What kind of stuff? Groceries. Just groceries. Yeah. Food. Yeah, that's right. No other stuff? No string? Or clothes? Or, or clothes or anything? Hardware. They, they have a bit of hardware, but, uh, but they need to uh, sell groceries. Okay. Yeah. Chinese food or like Chinese vegetables? Yeah, yeah but. We have a, a vegetable garden in the back of the store, and we we sell the vegetables there. Oh, yeah. So no, no meat, no chickens. I'll be back. Uh, so no, no no chickens. Yeah, we we had a farm at the end of the end of the town there, where it was higher because we had a we had a pig farm there, pig farm. The chicken. Uh, also, yeah, you, did, uh, you just have to do the best you can. That's so, all you can do. So, so, so your dad 
your dad, like the pigs and the chickens, your dad prepared all the pigs and the chickens to sell. To sell. Oh, oh yeah. So he, uh, two things. Um, who did, did it, was it just um, Chinese people who bought at the store? And, and did your family grow Chinese vegetables or white vegetables or both? So, like, so you know, bok choy, su choy. Like the, so, so, so did, did, did you sell Chinese vegetables, only Chinese vegetables, like, like bok choy and su choy? Yeah, we, 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 put, we, put, we grow a lot of vegetables there, right behind the store there. So did, did you sell low farm? Like, ah. did, you, did you also sell vegetables that the low farm bought? We, we sell them wholesale up to the store, at the store up there, uptown. So you also sold to Lofan? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, how, wait, so how did you sell to Lofan? Like, did you take the produce in a truck up to the store and sell that way, all the vegetables and chicken and pork? So, so, so when you sold to the Lofan, did you have a truck? Like, did you have a truck to deliver the, the, the vegetables and the meat to the Lofan? We, we did have a truck. Oh, did, did, did you get to drive the truck? I, I was too young. Oh, oh. So who drove the truck? My, my older, older brother. Oh. Yeah. Oh. No, too young. I never did, never did drive the truck. Oh, well, you had a truck to yeah. deliver. Oh, yeah. So you sold retail to Chinese and wholesale to the Lofan? So, so. So, 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 so to the low farm, did you sell to them wholesale, like, like to, to a, a, a restaurant and you'd sell lots and lots of vegetables? Yeah, sell them to, to the place that they sell vegetables up, uh, up town. Oh, oh yeah. wow. You're, so, you're, so you're a wholesaler. Yeah, that's right. Wow. A wholesaler. Yeah. Oh, that sounds like big business. Huh? A wholesaler makes it sound like that, that you're, that's big business if you're wholesaling. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Well, and you were you told you were actually fairly well off in Cumberland, right? Relatively speaking. Relatively speaking, you yeah. were you were not poor. Huh? You were not considered poor. In Chinatown, that's true. You were yeah. doing good. You were a merchant. Yeah, yeah. yeah. merchant yeah. family. Yeah. Was, was your store the biggest store? The China? Huh? Was your Chinese store the biggest Chinese store in Cumberland? Yeah, yeah. this one. Yeah, I think it was. Well, you know the Cumberland Museum, it has a, it says Chow Lee, uh, whatever. Chow, yeah, company. Chow Lee Company, so it must have been a big part of Cumberland, right? Yeah, that's right, yeah. Right there, yeah, yeah. you see that. Right. And, and, and the, the Lowe's had a big store too, right? Huh? The Lowe's in, in Cumberland had a big store also. But they were further out. Further the up. Further up. Yeah. Up the road. Hey, Douglas and Gaylene, I'm yeah. going to wrap this up pretty soon. Do you want to maybe um, one more picture or um, what, like one or two more follow-up questions? Sure, that, and then we should probably finish it up. That sounds good. Okay. Sure. Was there any pictures? Did she see these pictures? Yeah, she's seen all. Okay. But do you want to choose one more picture to ask your dad about? Okay. Well, we didn't really show the Uncle Bill's photo that much. Okay, well, you, you, I don't know where it went now. Uncle Bill's photo? If I have one, just a photo. In here? Maybe well, well, you know, separate. <laughs> no, 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 this one here. Just, just that one. Yeah, maybe that one. Well, well like I say, well, well, okay, got it. Thanks. We're all very close to our Uncle Bill's so that was, a, that was the that bill. that was the brother that Don't tell you. yeah the brother he moved to Victoria with yeah. Bill Chow yeah were um, you close um with Bill what are you are you were you close like were you close to Uncle Bill yeah I yeah. Took, yeah Uncle quite Bill. a close that family yeah right but you know closest to Uncle Bill right yeah yeah, quite, yeah. close to age in a way. <laughs> Close in age, but you also spent. No, Bill, uh, uh, part the older. Bill is the second. Right. And then, and then I was the third one. 
so, so what did you think when Uncle Bill joined the army? Huh? What did you think when Uncle Bill joined the army? He had no alternative. No alternative? No alternative. He had to join? He had to join? Yeah. Really? Oh. Yeah. How come he had to join? Uh, you don't join, you get conscripted anyway. Oh, 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 you get this. Oh. Was he drafted, your Uncle Bill? They did people in the army at that time. I don't think he was conscripted. Oh, oh, I, think he, I think he volunteered to go to India, right? Yeah, you had to raise your hand for Force 136. You had to say that it was something that you wanted. I think he volunteered. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, volunteered yeah. to go to yeah. Burma, that Burma thing. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's just what they did. This has been uh, amazing, you guys. Uh, I, I'm going to wrap it up here. Wayne, thank you. Thank you for talking to me. So you're welcome, Dad. She says thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, Good day. Every time. I'm going to. No, I'm not to do it to help. No problem. <laughs> Gaylene, it was lovely to sort of meet you <laughs> behind the screen. Yeah, nice to uh, chat with you too, Linda. Nice to become aware of you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I, I, this is the first time I've seen your face. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Thank you. And um, I will send yeah. you links for the recordings, Douglas and okay. everybody. And yeah. after that, we can talk about what you might want to do with them. Okay, yeah, okay. All right. Thanks, Thanks so much, Linda. Yeah. Okay, bye-bye. Yeah.